Lewis, congratulations. Thank How you. How happy are you to be staying here with us? Yeah, I'm delighted. Um, since I've come in, it's been a real positive vibe around the around the club. Um, the gaff has been brilliant with me. The, every goalkeeping coach I've had has been brilliant with me. And the fans especially as well, they've t- really taken to me and I'm pleased that that's happened. Yeah, there's been a few goalkeeping coaches as well, so plenty of yeah. opportunities to learn different things. Yeah, exactly that. Um, some might see it as a negative sometimes when there's keeper coaches coming in all the time, but for me, I like to learn off different people and different ideas, and each one of them has had different ideas, and they've all done well as well since moving on or whatnot. 12 games for you this season. How happy have you been with your progress? No, I'm delighted. Um, if you had told me at the start of the year I got 12 games or a bit in your hand off, um, I was fully expecting to go out on loan and just try to do well out there. But to get 11 games, I think, in the league and to keep six or seven clean sheets in that, I'm, I'm delighted. The players in front of you have got to be performing well as well, but I suppose right. it's up to you to marshal them as well. So it's it's all part of a unit, isn't it? That, that, that sequence of clean sheets. Yeah, exactly that. The, as you said, a unit, and that's what we are. It comes right from the front with Matty Stevens. I think in games he's been running 12k and it starts from him and it comes all the way back I think in games I've had no more than three or four saves to make so yeah it's a it's a good good unit to be behind and a good unit to marshal as well you got a bash a few weeks ago and had to go off and how are you off off the back of all of that because obviously it's been a case in and out of the team yeah no I'm fine after that um I was disappointed to come off but obviously precautions had to be taken and that's nothing I can I can affect but yeah, the Mansfield game I was disappointed with, with that second goal, but that's part and parcel of the game. I'm going to make mistakes, I'm going to do well at times. But yes, um, I've tried to react well on the training ground and do my bit with it within the team and help Jojo out now that he's playing. But for me, the ultimate aim is to get back in the team and get out of that number one shirt. And I suppose a new contract extension as well, just it gives you a little bit of a, a, a boost along the way. Yeah, definitely. Um, it, it helps knowing that your future is sorted for another year. Um, so it, it's a piece of my mind set on now that I can I can go out there and hopefully perform and just keep doing well and doing the best I can for the club and hopefully with that comes promotion and more games and yeah I'm just enjoying that. And the style of football that Forest Green play, how difficult, how enjoyable is that actually that they do play out from the back and yeah. you know you've got to be a bit more of a an Edison, a, a Bravo, an Allison rather than just the traditional goalkeeper. Yeah no um I thoroughly enjoy it. Um, if I can showcase what I can do with my feet, then it's only going to help me and help me progress as a goalkeeper. Um, I think the position's always evolving, so you have to be able to play with your feet and make saves. But this club's the perfect opportunity for a goalkeeper to start using his feet and get better with that. And then it helps when it, uh, other clubs are looking and they can see that you're playing well with your feet. But sometimes we have to change our tactics because teams are probably figuring us out a little bit. So. As if we can show we can go longer as well with accurate kicks, then that's all beneficial. Yeah, the manager loves to keep people guessing, doesn't he? Yeah. Top of League Two, couple of cup games, one in the FA Cup, one in the Trophy. Um, thoughts going into those? The thoughts going into them is just to keep the momentum going. Um, we want to do as well as we can in every competition. We, we're about winning games and the benchmark's been set by us. Being top of the league, we've got to continue to win games and continue playing well and hopefully we can get a real cup run going, and that would be nice for the fans and the club. Yeah, a cup run, just how exciting would that be? Because that's the one thing that hasn't really happened in the last couple of years here, as good as they've been. Yeah, cup runs are always exciting, when, especially when the Championship and Premier League teams come into it. It gives us an opportunity to showcase our talents against them and see how we can go up against them and hopefully play well. But yeah, a cup run is exciting for any club. You want to go as far as you can in any competition, and that's what we're aiming to do. And presumably just itching to get back out there with the gloves on. Definitely, yes. <laughs> Good man, thank you. Thank you. Lewis, Mark Cooper said when he took you out of the team after Mansfield that it would actually long-term be beneficial for you. Do you, do you agree with that? Um, I'm hoping so, yeah. I, th- I think he's got a point. Um, for me, it was just getting how many hope, getting a run of games, and um, I feel I got a good run of games. It was unfortunate that it came after one mistake, but... That's part and part of the game, and I'm going to improve and keep learning from that. And it must be great to work with a keeper like Jojo as well. I mean, there's there's not much in it between you both. You're no, both there's really not. at your game. Yeah, Jojo's a fantastic keeper, and he's settled in really well. And I'm, I enjoy working with him and Adam and um, Dan as well. So it's um, it's a really good goalkeeping group, and uh, we're a real tight unit. Cheers. <laughs>